Let's talk about why most network marketers fail, how to overcome that so that you are not one of those network marketers that do fail, but also what type of marketing strategies are going to set you up for success. That's what we're going to be talking about in today's video. And the first thing that I want to say is number one, the most common reason why network marketers fail is because they don't have clear expectations as to what is expected of them and how long it's going to take. And so I want to be the first person to tell you possibly that it is going to take a lot of work to be successful in network marketing. Anybody that says that it's a, you know, get rich quick scheme, it is definitely not get rich quick. It's get rich maybe eventually, but it's going to take a lot of work, a lot of time, a lot of building, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. Because the reality is, is you are an entrepreneur, right? What network marketing is, is it's a business in a box for you set up, but you have to go and do the work very early on to set up yourself for success. So I remember when I first got started back in network marketing almost a decade ago, I remember selling it as stupid easy money really, really bad marketing strategy, right? Like that did not work very well for me because what I found is yes, I did have some success in the beginning because I have what we call a nice warm market. But what I found is after you go through that warm market, it actually becomes a lot of work. And so for me to go and tell people that it was stupid, easy money was definitely a miss miscalculation. And anybody that tells you that is going to be lying to you too. So number one, I want to make sure that you have very clear expectations that it takes a lot of work, a lot of time, a lot of personal development, a lot of building into knowing yourself and knowing how to market yourself because it's one of those things that is never taught typically in school, right? So if you're getting started in network marketing or if you're already started in network marketing, you need to know that it is going to take time right? It's like learning a new language. Nobody can learn a new language overnight, right? If you started to learn Spanish, right? It's going to take you years to be fluent in Spanish. The same thing happens with network marketing. So number one, you have got to have clear expectations when it comes to network marketing. When you see people sometimes and maybe in your company and they're like, oh my God, they had success so quickly. You don't know what their point A was. You are expecting to be at their point Z. Maybe they've been in network marketing for years, right? And they've learned the language and they've learned how to market themselves better on social media or better marketing strategies, right? So just know, number one, that it is going to take time, it is going to take work, and it's going to take learning from you in order to be better. Number two, they don't have a great training and a plan in place, right? They have what we call squirrel, where you're like, okay, I'm going to go all over on TikTok. No, nope, I'm just kidding. I'm going to go all over and on Instagram. No, nope, I'm just kidding. I'm going to go all in on Facebook or YouTube or wherever it is, right? This is what I'm going to say. The grass is green where you water it. Where are you going to water your network marketing company, right? Where are you going to water your brand and get better at your marketing? Pick one. Now, what I recommend where I've built my business to the top is over here on YouTube. If you want my free masterclass on how I've built my business to the top levels in the network marketing space, just click on the description of this video. You're going to see my free masterclass on how I've been able to build my business using YouTube, right? But you want to have a clear marketing plan in place. And if you don't have one, go to your upline, your sideline, your downline, and see what are the systems that they have in place. And if they don't have the systems, then unfortunately, you're going to have to create them yourself, right? But you're going to be setting yourself up for success and your team up for success if you start to put those measures into place. And remember, this is your business, right? So you want to treat it like a business and you want to have the systems in place for if and when you are going to have a team. Now, if you want to check out this video that I've made on how I've recruited hundreds of people, I'm going to link it right here for you. After you've watched this video, definitely make sure you go and you check out this video because I'm going to give you all of my recruiting tips on how I've been able to build a you know very successful network marketing business here on social media and have recruited hundreds of people, right? But again, I digress. Let's talk about the third thing that people forget when it comes to network marketing, right? And the third reason why they don't have success. They don't have success because they want quick and instant rewards. 
This is network marketing. It's a relationship building business, right? And they're so busy focusing on recruiting and getting people to join their team without actually getting to know who they are and having those deep connections, right? People buy from you because they like, know, and trust you. People want to join your team. They want to work with you because they like, know, and trust you. And so often what happens is when people get started in network marketing, they're so eager for the sale. They're so eager for that rank advancement. They're so eager for that success that they've been promised so quickly that they forget about the relationship building. And they come off to be very, very spammy, very, very um, repelling to their audience, right? We have what we like to call commission breath, right? Where they're not looking at the person as a human. The reason that I have been able to have so much success in this industry is number one, because I've been consistent. Number two, because I have dove deep into personal and professional development. And number three, I was a therapist before I got started in network marketing. And so I'm really good about building relationships. And I truly think that building those relationships and wanting and caring about people more than just a sale or a number on my team has benefited me exponentially, right? And so what I want to ask you is if you're not having the success that you want to be having, or if you are just getting started in this network marketing space, definitely make sure you're examining these tips to see if there is something that is a missing hole for you in your, you know, in your funnel. If these type of videos are helpful for you, definitely make sure you subscribe to my channel. I put out a ton of content that's here to help network marketers. And again, if you're wanting to build on YouTube, which I strongly recommend, if you want to build on YouTube, I'm going to put for you my masterclass that I have for you in the description of this video. But I'm telling you, when you start to put systems in place, when you start to be consistent, when you start to understand that you own a business and that it is not um, an easy business, but it takes work and strategy, but it's a business in a box, so it makes it so much easier to get started in an online business, then you are going to have so much more success. Do not expect to be successful right from the get-go, right? It is, that is not a clear expectation of what network marketing is. Are there some stories about that? Absolutely, there are some people, but there's far more people that have not had success from the get-go. Like I like to say, I'm a 10-year success story over here, right? It's taken me over a decade of being consistent to have the success that I've wanted on social media. So again, if this content is helpful, definitely make sure you subscribe to my channel. I put out weekly content that is going to help you rock your business here on social media. And again, get my free masterclass on YouTube. I'm excited to be connected. And thank you for another episode of Julie Reynolds TV.